back to Adobe's temple. Um, first of all, I apologize for my voice. I'm really sick. Really sick. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um, also, the second thing is, I noticed that I've never done um, electric healer guide on the channel. <coughs> I did every single power, even for the like the videos. If not a guide, it's gonna be like a short video. Um, yeah. So, considering that the whole server is electric now, let's talk about it. So, for electric, the loadout that everyone use, um, like this loadout has been out for like ages. Everyone has been using that loadout, but there's a new loadout, uh, and I'm gonna say why soon. So the old loadout is going to be um, this, the Bioelectric Surge, Recover, Biocapacitor, Galvanize, Flux, which is your shield, and the Group Transducer, which is your supercharged shield, like the 8-man shield. It's really strong as well. So, that's the old spec, like the um, Ego Superpower, Critically Enchanted and Magnitude, Restoration, Might and Power, and Dom. The uh, weapon, whatever you want. Uh, super speed, you, you, yeah, whatever you want as well, or whatever movement you are. Uh, Iconics, you don't really need anything unless you're gonna spam supercharge. So you take Fairman Bloom and um, Speed Drain and um, Metallic Boost, or any other two supercharges in your icon, in your uh, movement tree. So, uh, for the artifacts. Page of Destiny, Purple Healing Ray, and Transformation. This is the old setup that we all know, okay? But um, less than a week ago, something changed, which is thanks to this guy. So Shazam, when he dropped uh, his second passive, um, made you, if you really want to benefit from it, I mean, it's, it's a choice anyway. If you really want to benefit from it, um, you really have to have more heals in your loadout um, to allow you to not uh, to not press priority on group heal like every two seconds basically because if you read the description here it says that weapon attacks grant a stack of 1% of restoration up to 25 stacks at uh, rank, to, uh, rank 10 so basically what that means is every time you hit um, an enemy with your weapon attack you build in a stack up to 25 hits so you have a 25 stacks which is 25% increase when you press a priority or a group heal that resets so what you want to do is you either don't have Shazam at all or you basically change your loadout to have more heals than just galvanizing group heal uh, sorry um, like um, <clears throat> so um, I heard this from a very good player, and yeah, I'm not really familiar with Electric, but yeah, he's uh, he's really good. So basically, in some content, you won't really need your Flux Shield, because your weapon buff with Clarion can give you a shield already. And it's kind of the same strength, actually, or maybe it might be a little bit weaker. So if you have if you have your weapon buff and Electro Burst, which actually heals AOE, and it's I would say it's like mm, it's it's like a gray range heal basically. And if no one knows what a gray range is, it's basically you see that red uh, target lock on the target in here. When you see that as a gray, like basically right now, look at that. It's great, that means it's great range. And as far as I know, I think that power hits great range for heals. You're not talking about damage, it's heals. So you can cycle between your shield from Clarion, that heal, Galvanize and uh, Biocap. Um, so you're gonna find yourself using your group heal and priority less often. Does, that doesn't mean that if you see a group die and be like, oh wait, sorry guys, no, I need to build my stacks, one sec, one sec, no. No, you press it normally, but I just find myself in so many situations where I just notice that I've been spamming my weapon for like, what, two, three minutes and no one is taking any damage. So why don't I just like help him with damage with the, um, with the weapon buff 
and actually heal them with clarion as well and build my stacks so when a big attack comes um, I can just you know boom because the priority with like 25 stacks on um, it really it's, it's basically like orb so yeah <clears throat> also I'll talk about art swapping soon um, yeah so this is actually the loadout that I've been using to be fair lately because of Shazam also for the allies because you're gonna use Shazam if you're not gonna use Shazam I would say you need you can put cyborg there instead you know help him with the power why not um, but yeah Batman who laughs is it's kind of right for heals so far you can't really replace him with any other thing so far so yeah uh, the cards are handy power um, stats, health, all of that. It's, it's, it would do good. Uh, for combat, that's what I've changed, or many people actually will have it different. So, Death Metal Batman, <coughs> his um, when he debuffs um, an enemy, uh, his debuff stacks with the troll debuff. So basically, basically you help the DPSs burn the boss or the ads faster. So it's a personal preference, whatever you want to have. You want to have him for helping the DPSs, or you just want to have um, another ally for um, for damage or whatever. So, if you want to have Harley for damage, you know, it's fine. Um, yeah, anything you want, Crypto for single target, just up to you basically. But I would say if you really want to do what I'm doing right now and have Shazam and uh, Batman Who Laughs, those are the two must. I don't really care about the combat. To be I mean, it can, you can see already, he's level 4 and both of them are 10, <laughs> so yeah. Um, I think, I think that's it for the, um, for the pure healing, right? I didn't forget anything. Yeah, I mean, everything's just standard, basically, the, the, mo the mods you guys know. Nah, Fermi Blue, if you spamming Supercharge, Groups and Juicer, if you, um, <clears throat> if you're pure healing with the old loadout. Uh, restoration. I was uh, I was uh, DPS yesterday, so I didn't change up. <laughs> so it's gonna be focused restoration. The back is. Um, I mean, bio cap is not really that great. You can go for with, with flux if you want to. Um, power efficiency if you spamming, and you have scarab at 200. If you don't, you need extend supercharge in here. Uh, legs don't really matter. Oh, that was when I was celestial old days. So feed Trample and Master and um, the hands, whatever you want. Max damage, shield, anything. And yeah, the utility belt, whatever you want as well. If you want to have a pet that helps you, the trinket uh, healer pet, supply and orbital. By the way, the trinket healer pet, and I've seen many people doing that, like before even the, the five starts, they just pop it. <coughs> it basically lasts for less than 10 seconds. So you're using it. If like all your powers are on cooldown and you have one power and you know it won't heal that much, so you pop it so it boosts that power and you heal more basically, because it it boosts your restoration by a lot. It gives you it says in here, yeah, thirteen thousand restoration, which is not too bad actually, for twelve seconds. So yeah, um. Yeah, I think that's it for that one. So, moving on to AOG healer. So, for AOG, <coughs> as I said, your head's gonna be Fairway Bloom, or whatever you wanna have. That's the only thing that's gonna change. And the artifacts, you're gonna have Eye of Gemini, Purple Healing Ray, and Scarf Soul Cloak. Okay. Um, also, for, yeah, for Eye of Gemini healing, because I won't have a shield, I would rather have personal damping field. So every time I see like an ad on me or something, I have at least like three more seconds to survive with that shield until the tank pulls them. So I find that really handy. And if you want to do like a quick damage, you can just like you can have it on the last slot, so you can just like um, sorry that was a mistake there. So you can just like um, swap between anything you want basically. So yeah, it's not really that difficult. <coughs> for the loadout this time, it's gonna be for me. I've seen people using different ones. Uh, it's gonna be your priority, galvanize, and biocapacitor. Okay, and any three superchargers you use. 
um, I I found this really I mean it's really better than the other ones I've seen because I've seen people using this loadout here but you don't really need um, a group heal if you're not gonna use a page of destiny I would rather have viral cap so at least it works like page of destiny a bit you know and I mean, Gavanize is a 3 second cooldown, which is the same as um, the group heal anyway, so you can definitely heal between those. I, I find it really actually better, way better, than having a group heal and Gavanize alone. Um, actually, I've seen people going wild and actually having this loadout in here as well. You replace the priority with a group heal. <laughs> I, I don't know how they do that, but yeah, I've seen it happens one time. Um, so, for the allies, I think I touched on this on my sorcery guide before. Nothing changed in here. You have your Batman who laughs. Uh, you have uh, Emperor Aquaman for his first passive because of uh, your spamming supercharge. So your combat ally will be off, um, basically come off cooldown faster. So you can spam him and the DPS will be happy basically. <coughs> because you, yeah, you have enough damage. If you want to go really over the edge and you want to swap um, Batman Who Laughs with Shazam, first passive, not second one. So every time you summon your pet or you summon your combat ally, uh, your precision might be increased so your weapon attacks hit harder. I mean, it's, it's yeah, it's one of the things that you, if you want to do to help the DPSs or help the group get whatever they want to faster, basically. And yeah, other than that, you just don't do anything special. You just build your supercharge, spam it, all of that. I should have done that before the video, but hey ho. <laughs> uh, when you're sick, you don't think straight, I guess. But yeah, this is literally what you do with electric. Uh, for art swapping, let's go back to pure heal again. For art swapping, um, I would rather you have like the things you're gonna swap to on the first four slots in here because it makes life so much easier and also because we all know when you go to your inventory you're automatically selected the first slot in here so whatever you have you need as a priority you need to stay there like I've seen people for example swap in page of destiny in here swapping it with uh, scarf soul cloak so they leave it they keep it there they pop a supercharge go to the inventory pop their um, their uh, page of destiny uh, so they stack the group heal and also if you're gonna do that you need to remove bio cap they swap that and by the time the next supercharge is ready they swap sky of soul cloak again if you want to do that you know so i'll swap it it's completely optional uh, but yeah for what i've been doing sometimes if the content is really like makes you on your toes um, that's what I do when I was sorcery basically I used to to art swap um, um, transformation with eye of Gemini before I pop my supercharge okay and then when I pop the supercharge I, I change it with orb because basically yeah your orb heals like crazy um, it's a big burst heal and also, you can swap orb with um, with your transformation. So you can basically do this: the orb is not ready, you pop it, and then you switch back to the transformation. So you have the orb healing, and you healing normally as well. Your um, your priority won't really um, cause that much because you already took off the orb. So yeah, it's not just a matter of how fast you wanna do things, basically. That's all. I think I've covered everything, yeah. <laughs> Nothing else to do, basically. Um, yeah. Don't forget to buff yourself before going to the raids. Um, yeah. As the same as I mentioned in the um, um, AOG healer, you can swap as well your like, henchmen or something if you want to call them and then and call your supply again or brutal whatever but yeah nothing that crazy at all
all your Batman hole apps, you attack so you get your um, your shield. Oh yeah, somehow, I don't know why, but um, you need to, in order to get a shield, you need to hit a target as soon as you press your weapon buff, otherwise it won't be active. Well, it doesn't want to be active now, I don't know what's going on. Oh wait, I didn't equip. <laughs> Look at this dude. <laughs> I don't have your equipped. Bruh. My bad, sorry. Yeah, there you go. <coughs> you never want to do that when you odd swap. Um, yeah, I think I think we're fine. So we're gonna. Oh, they disappeared. Never mind. Okay, so I think that's fine so far. I am gonna disappear. I'm gonna have my medicine, and I'm gonna enjoy the rest of the day. So guys take care uh by the way the oh my god i hate living in here anyway um i'm gonna upload a video soon about um pa buff buff drill gonna have a buff troll with that buff troll spec or whatever because i made this um a secret character that everyone will love the name of yeah and yeah it's perfect so Watch out for that soon, and I'll see you soon. Bye!